Hello YouTube and uh, welcome to my boiler room. Um, today I'm uh, going to make a sort of a public service announcement regarding uh, the perks with the smoking plug tobacco. Uh, the reason for this is that it's come to my knowledge that uh, certain fishermen and maybe even fisherwomen uh, are unaware of uh, the benefits that come with uh, smoking plug tobacco while fishing and what I'm talking about is uh, its ability to withstand uh, water or getting wet and I'm going to make a practical example here I've got some uh, Yachtsman Navy plug hard as a brick and here I've got a glass of water and what I plan to do <laughs> I haven't done this before so <laughs> I hope it's working well if you if it doesn't work I won't put it up so I'm going to put the plug in the water let it sit there for two seconds or three seconds or then pick it up dry it just wipe it off and cut it up put it in my pipe and uh, smoke it so let's get on with it one piece of plug in water and then I've got my handkerchief here it loses some uh, color or it's, it stains the handkerchief but it, it feels pretty much the same as it did before and uh, now I'll cut it up and the way I do with plugs is I cut it into small cubes uh, but then I have uh, a mix in in between the cubes I put some thin slices that I rub out just to get the uh, it going uh, no sign of uh, water or moisture in here And I'm not saying you can you can go swimming with the uh, with your plug, but uh, what I'm saying is that it if you're outdoors in wet conditions and you're afraid your tobacco would get wet, plugs your uh, thing. Take a slice and I rub it out on top of the cubes I put in. Put in some more cubes. This tobacco has a lovely aroma. It's really, 
rich dark chocolate dark chocolate and uh, a, a little burly earthiness but mostly the rich chocolate is smell and I know from before that if I smoke this too fast uh, I'm going to feel like I've had too much dark chocolate so I'll be smoking this in a slow and steady tempo I rub out some flakes on top By the way, the knife, Mora knife, made in Sweden, probably the most common knife in Sweden, and it's really good. I know they sell them in the States in a bigger, tougher version. This is the workman's version of it. It's really good. It stays sharp. No, it didn't pack it tight enough. and tastes tastes well so uh, I hope I have proved my point and uh, those of you who haven't tried plug and are outdoors a lot try it not only will you get the uh, water resistant tobacco you'll get uh, a tobacco with a lot of taste in it it's yeah i think it has a, a, a richer more mature taste than, than uh, ordinary rubbed out or flake tobacco so with that I'll uh, bid you go goodbye thanks for watching take care and uh, I hope to see you soon bye